did a coding lesson in our English lesson um, based on algorithms and I related the algorithm to um, to a dance move that I'd seen recently on, on social media. So I thought I'd use it in the classroom and this kind of how I did it. I started off sharing this video from the BBC which explains what algorithms are and how basically they're just a set of instructions. Then I showed the video of the dance to the children and what they had to do is they had to see if they could figure out what the algorithm is. They had pen and paper and they tried to work out the sequence that each dancer did. The first few times the children watched the video I made sure it was on mute because if you watch the original video the dancers give away some clues of the dance move so I made sure it was on mute to start with. Then the children decided to record their codes down on paper. Some of them did diagrams, some of them ran sentences, some of them did um, in pictures to explain how to do the dance. And they all got it down on paper and then I just decided to annoy Charlie a little bit here. Sorry Charlie. Then the key bit is we had to go outside and try it. We had to try the dance. The children had to practice the dance moves based on the algorithm they had worked out. Um, it was really interesting to see because some of them got it completely wrong and found it more difficult. Some of them used the squares on the floor just to practice and give it a go. And it was really interesting to see them watch it, watch it happen. And I got them to use the words debugging and bugging and algorithms throughout this part of the session. Then using masking tape I created um, the, the squares for the children to give it a proper go and each group had their turn and it's really funny because the children found it way more difficult at first um, but we, we got round it in the end and the way we got round it is we all helped each other out by um, shouting the instructions and the algorithm as they went and here's a really good example of it working perfectly well. Two, three, two, one, go, up, up, diagonal, up, diagonal, everyone, up. kids went back to their groups and created their own dances and their own algorithms. There you go, so that's what we did in class today. Now I've done, I've done this before, I've done the triangle dance, I've done um, what was it? Oh God, the floss dance which was a couple of years ago, but I've also done the, the foot shake dance as well. So um, use dance moves in class and to teach coding, it's just a really fun way and the kids really, really enjoy it and it gets them active and outside as well. Mm -hmm.